fiery and downright bizarre scene in downtown Miami. An empty car plummeting nine stories inside a parking garage. This morning, city engineers will check to make sure the building is safe. CBS 4's Riel Creighton is live in downtown Miami with what caused this wild scene. Riel. Hi, good morning, Lauren and Mary Bell. Well, the owner tells us that it was a parking attendant who left his car in the wrong gear, and that caused it to plummet some nine stories down and then burst into flames. The cell phone video shows the flames and thick smoke filling this elevator shaft in a downtown Miami parking garage along Biscayne Boulevard. This is just not, it's not a car to me. It's, this is my, this is my, my baby. Matt Aleknowitz looked on as his 2005 Acura TL fell nine floors, then burst into flames at around six Tuesday night. Nobody was inside. Crews then spent hours putting out the fire and taking the charred shell away from the building, which is across the street from Bayfront Park. I've been on the job for about three weeks now. He and his co-workers at the building next door told to use the valet service. Parking workers use elevators for the cars to go from floor to floor. Lechnowitz says he got an explanation as to why he no longer has his Acura. It's a manual car, so they left it in gear. And when they went to get the car, they started the car, and the car jumped forward and uh, fell on a elevator shaft. Since 2005, he had poured thousands of dollars into sprucing up his whip. No factory parts in that car. Everything's redone. It was a low rider with special rims, TVs inside, a $3,000 stereo, a $500 computer chip, and LED lights on the bottom of the car. It's not about the money. It's not. It's, it's, you can't put. Uh, you can't replace something you had forever. You know. So I'm like. It's almost like I'm saying my goodbyes right now to the car. As Aleknowitz says his final farewell to his car, he will now lean on a ride-sharing service to take him to and from work. Once he's behind the wheel of his own car again, he says he will give the garage a second chance. If I'm, if I'm working there, then I have to park the car there. And his car incinerated. As you can imagine, Electomus tells us that he plans on contacting his insurance company today. The parking garage telling us they plan to do the same. We're live in downtown Miami, Riel Creighton, CBS4 this morning.